Hey guys, so I'm gonna give you guys a quick uh, demonstration of how I do my uh, cured salmon. So this is the salmon that I usually get. It is uh, wild sakai. Uh, they do come in frozen, um, roughly about a six to eight ounce size. So what you do first is ju just tap it to dry. Uh, usually uh, it does have some liquid from uh, being previously frozen and very very simple so what I do is uh, I place it in a small plate and for the six ounce size I roughly add about uh, two and a half grams of Himalayan salt just uh, sprinkle it right on top and uh, what you do next is uh, just uh, uh, wrap it and uh, place it back in the fridge for at least uh, a good four hours. So after four hours, this is what you actually get. Uh, this is your salmon, it's already uh, cured. And we're gonna start to slice it up as well too. And the best way is to uh, get a nice uh, sharp knife. Uh, again, tap it to dry if you have to. And... Uh, Get ready to slice it as uh, thin as possible. And there you go, never eat the skin. And there you go, there's your uh, cured sakai salmon, uh, ready to consume, uh, super fresh, uh, very very tasty and it's amazing. If you like you can add a little bit more Himalayan salt on it and that's it. This is roughly about a 6 ounce. Um, if you like you can uh, add some uh, egg yolk on top or this could be like a side dish and uh, definitely enjoy it. Another uh, great tip from mycarnivorecoach.com